Hi everyone, Dana Hall here. Um, so I kind of decided to tell my story via video. Um, I do write it out sometimes, I blog about it, um, and it's on my Facebook like page, my Facebook page, and here and there. Um, but I thought I would talk about it on video. And it's not going to be all at once, I'll do this in sections, I don't know how long it's going to take. But I'm just going to start from the beginning. Um, so I'm 33 years old, I was born and raised in a small town in Pennsylvania. Um, my parents divorced when I was 11 years old. Um, I lived with my mom for a year, and then uh, we moved in with my dad. Um, and I love my dad to death. Um, he's amazing. He's my hero. Um, and I just have to say that um, as far as eating growing up, it wasn't the best. Um, actually, it was so far from the best. Um, I had Pop-Tarts, uh, frozen bagels, uh, cereal. For breakfast, those are my breakfast options. I might have had oatmeal in there, maybe. Um, let's see, chips were always present in our house, um, frozen pizzas. Um, my dad did cook dinner, um, so that was probably the healthiest I ate. And then school lunches, which I'm not sure if you consider those healthy. Um, and then, uh, you know, on the weekends, we had a lot of pastries in the house. Friday nights was pizza night. Um, so. I didn't eat well, and um, my dad, um, he later on says, I did, wasn't thinking, like, for him, it was really easy for him to lose weight. He, you know, is a mason, and he's looking at me blocks all day, um, so he's being able to burn all those, off those calories, um, however, his children aren't as active, so um, needless to say, I gained weight, and I was probably at my heaviest when I was 18 years old. Um, I was completely uncomfortable in my skin. Um, I would wear a t-shirt and shorts over my bathing suit and I'm talking about a one-piece bathing suit. Um, I always wore layers and not in like a fashion sense because I don't even think it was in fashion then. It was more like to hide my roles um, and feel comfortable. Um, I was a tomboy at one point because I thought it was cool and then I think I kept it because um, guys clothes were better and just I didn't know any better. I also didn't have a fashion sense but um, I just always felt awkward and uncomfortable, and when I turned 18, I was just like, I don't want to continue this. Um, I want to wear a bikini, so, and I didn't know what to do. So my best friend, who is older than me, uh, ran all the time, and she had six-pack abs like um, Jennifer Grey and uh, Dirty Dancing. I was like, okay, that's what I'll do. And so I started, and I was slow, and I was terrible at it. Um, but I continued and at the end of that summer I did wear a bikini. I don't think I wore it in public, but I could put a bikini on. Um, and I still had a ways to go, but I was so far from where I was. Um, I wish I could show the picture. It's on my blog, barefootanddaydreaming.com. You can see it. There's a, there's a blog post called I've been around the block and there's a picture of me. I think it's the day I graduated high school and it's just hard to look at. Um, it's just amazing difference. Uh, and then after that, I went to college and I gained the freshman 15. Um, like everyone else, I came back from, for Christmas break and I asked my dad, I was like, have I gained weight? And he's like, yes. And I was like, all right. And I went back and, um, I gave up food for Lent and not fruit food. <laughs> I gave up food. I gave up, um, sweets for Lent and I think eating in between meals. And at that time, um, my class schedule, um, I had to walk to all my classes and none of them were near each other. So I got a lot of walking in and I ended up losing the, the freshman 15. Um, but I did go um, a lot of, you know, I always had a fluctuate of up five, down five, up five, down five. Um, and I was a little bit better with my eating, but I still, um, you know, I struggled. Um, and I wasn't, I still had my moments of just not being comfortable. I was never truly comfortable in my skin at this point. Um, I did get a little bit better fashion sense, I will tell you that much. Um, and I did, uh, you know, there were moments where I felt like I was losing weight. Was I doing it the healthy way? No, because I remember when I was running and I would be having fried foods all the time. And uh, you, know, you just don't feel good on that. You feel tired and lethargic and just, you can't sustain a diet like that and think that your body's um, handling it well. Um, so yeah, so that's, that's the point where I'm going to go ahead and leave this video at, um, stay tuned for when I come back and talk about the next part of my life and the different things that I did. Um, thanks for tuning in.